The introduction raises a question about two permanent institutions in human life, political communities and families. There is obviously some sort of relationship between these two things. Democracies generally have democratic families. Oligarchies generally have oligarchic families. The idea of justice that informs a political community also informs the family. So there is a fatal circle around what you can expect from a family in any particular political community that is determined by that political community's nature, by its understanding of justice. We live in a democracy, a democracy that is becoming increasingly, um, uh, embraces the idea of individual rights increasingly. Um, so coming up with a defense of the family within that fatal circle of a modern democracy is a great challenge. And partly, this introduction lays out the ways in which our political community challenges the family life and also points to the way in which the family can also challenge the political community. And that's the task of the book as a whole, is to lay out how defending the family can pose a challenge to an individualistic democracy.